Hey guys, I brought the cooler inside the house. Here it is right here. Let's take a look. It's us. Hey guys, thanks for watching another Jack Leg Act video. My name is Mushki, your Master Jack Leg. With the extreme cold outside, I figured it's a great time to try making clear ice. First thing you will need is a cooler. Second thing you need is some water. I'm going to use the fridge water as it is filtered. Then you set the cooler outside with the top open and let it freeze for roughly 24 hours. So I'm going to do all that and we'll check back in tomorrow. See you then. Hey guys. So it's been 24 hours and I brought the cooler inside the house. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to pour out any of the extra water that hasn't froze yet from the bottom of the cooler out into the sink and hopefully catch the ice block. So let's get to it. Okay. Okay. That's kind of what we got after 24 hours and as you can see pretty clear there's a couple air bubbles in there but overall I'm pretty happy so let's move on to the shaping cutting and breaking of the block into cubes okay so we have spun the camera around I got the block of ice on a little dish towel I also have a meat tenderizer or some kind of hammer mallet uh, I also got an old bread knife that we don't really use anymore. Any kind of long serrated knife will work. Uh, what we're going to do is we're just going to clean this block up. Uh, I also got a towel because this is going to melt while we're working on it. And a couple bags to put the cubes in. Uh, so starting at the top here, we're going to try and clean up that edge that uh, was in contact with the cooler. And it made that ridge up on it. You can kind of see that. So all I'm going to do is just take the knife here and kind of shave up at this side here and shave that ridge down. So now we're going to start the actual cutting process and the breaking. So what we're going to want to do is we're going to make square cubes in this case. So you're going to generally want like an inch and a half by inch and a half. So just by looks, we're going to say something like maybe this. So some more, that's probably more like a two inch piece. So we'll make a nice straight line. I mean, you could break out a ruler if you got that crazy about it, but just kind of go pretty straight. And you're going to saw with your serrated knife and get into that ice a bit. <laughs> Front to back, you want to have a nice crease, and what that is doing is that's creating a fissure in the ice block. And I have a baby that's sleeping upstairs, so I'm going to kind of go a little further than you have to, just to make the next step a little easier. But once you get a real nice crease in there, you can take your mallet, your hammer, your block, your can of soup, whatever, whatever you have on hand, and eventually it'll break. And if you see, I kind of got a little corner here that didn't break all the way. So I probably should hit on the knife a little bit further out. But still, have a great piece of ice here to work with. Uh, let's put this aside a little bit. Then we do the same thing on these little pieces as we did on the big one. I'm just going to try and make a cube here. So this is thicker than this side. So we're going to make a nice thicker piece here. We'll go probably about that far make something close to a cube here. So again, just going to saw it front to back, and then that one just broke. So then there we go, we have a big block cube of ice.
kind of shape this down in the sink if you wanted. You know, you just rub on this high edge and within seconds, especially if you do it with like a warmer rag, it'll smooth it out. You know, you can kind of go around, smooth it all down, and just in this quick 10 seconds that I'm doing it right here, I mean, I mean, that looks so much better. So you can just smooth out your rough edges on it. Uh, so like I said, I'm going to cut this all up, break it all up, and I will return. Welcome back everyone. I have finished breaking up the ice. And yes, it was a good amount of work. And I don't know about you, but I think it was well worth the time and energy. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Please give it a like and subscribe to the channel. And leave me a comment down below. Tell me how your ice turned out or what I should try on the rocks next time. And until then, Mushi out.